Carta is a Silicon Valley-based company that operates in the rig tech segment of the financial services industry. The company has been adding a lot of different businesses over the years that support the regulatory reporting and compliance functions associated with public and private companies. For instance, they can serve as the SEC registered transfer agent for private companies that help enable seed stage companies as well as pre-IPO firms to manage equity electronically. This is important because of the number of different equity participants and players involved with early stage firms, such as founders, external shareholders, venture capitalists, employees, auditors, and legal counsel. Carta also offers the digitization of paper stock certificates, along with stock options, warrants, and derivatives to create a real-time image of who owns what in a startup firm. Founded by Manu Kamar and Henry Ward in 2012 as eShares, Carta is based in Mountain View, California. The company began when co-founder Kumar realized that there was a large disconnect between purchasing or investing in shares of public companies versus private companies, and he knew there had to be a better way. Digitization was something that could be employed to help with all of the regulations and paperwork that for private companies was oftentimes overwhelming. Specifically, he noticed that when a public company issues equity, it results in an online transaction once an employee, investor, or advisor receives options. However, in a private company investment, the investor still receives paper stock certificates, which was a problem worth solving in Manu's eyes. Manu knew he was onto something, and he reached out to Henry Ward to become the CEO of Carta, which at the time was referred to as eShares. Carta is privately held and was jump-started with an accelerator incubator in 2012 that was followed by early seed rounds in 2012 and 2013, which provided $2 million led by Union Square Venture Capital. Starting in 2014, Carta began series investments with Union Square, Spark Capital, and Subtraction Capital. Over the years, Carta has received funding from an impressive group of investors, including the previously mentioned funds, as well as Draper, Expansion, Canine Venture, Elefund, and others. Zenefits, another fintech player in Silicon Valley, took notice of Carta's potential and partnered with them in 2016 to provide another platform offering for Carta. In 2017, a major $42 million round of investments was obtained from Menlo Ventures and Social Capital, which was followed up a year later with an $80 million investment from Tribe Capital and Meritech Capital Partners. As the result of funding Carta, it has received unicorn status with a valuation of nearly $2 billion. Furthermore, Carta was ranked number 44 in the Forbes Cloud 100 list. The last funding round, in 2019 was a Series E $300 million venture investment led by Andreas and Horowitz. Looking into Carta and its products and services and the needs that it fulfills, it can simply be described as a firm that's attempting to change how assets are acquired, valued, and transacted in the private equity space. TechCrunch defines Carta as a developer of an ownership management and compliance platform designed to consolidate company ownership data onto one common electronic registry. Carta services are tailored to help investors, specifically ones more inclined to invest in private companies, such as founders, employees, venture capitalists, who want to manage their own equity and ownership structure. More specifically, Carta aids private companies in streamlining and managing their equity issuance from founding to initial price offering, with some of the features such as cap table software, secondary reporting, and 409A valuations. There are many regulations surrounding investment financing, such as KYC, or Know Your Customer, and AML, or Anti-Money Laundering Compliance, which currently has no set standard in the industry for private firms. However, firms and investors need to be aware of the strict laws and how it applies to their fund. Thus, Carta has created such a system and put it in place to address KYC and AML compliance issues. 
Carta offers capabilities on a unique platform that are offered by few others. Carta's top feature is their cap table which is a management tool, which is referred to as the source for truth for company equity. It's followed by 409A valuations, which are considered the industry leader in audit ready and cost effective 409K reporting. Next, Carta offers a tool which conveniently provides liquidity estimates by running one-off transactions, tender offers, and stock buybacks, which are then followed by transfer agent tools which serve as a SEC registered transfer agent with best in class offerings. Additionally, there are electronic securities, which issue securities to stakeholders who can then virtually accept and exercise options on Carta's electronic platform. In addition to scenario modeling tool, which serves as a sensitivity and breakpoint analysis feature that can also analyze products, payouts and dilution features. Carta is attractive as an all-in fund administrator that can help firms address the financial and regulatory obligations of their private fundings. Besides the legal and regulatory requirement, the system can provide periodic financial reports and informal touch points with a firm's private investors, including up-to-date performance information on the fund. This list of features that Carta offers on their platform is impressive as they can offer services that touch more than 700,000 shareholders and 14,000 companies whose fund administrative products presently serve over 150 different venture capital firms. The companies they can serve, con consult consist of some very respectable names, including Robinhood, Greycoff, Intercom, USV, Flexport, and Axios, just to name a few. And finally, Carta aims to break the mold in regard to how private equity capital markets operate and that they want to provide a future private equity trading platform. In regard to their future, Carta has impressive funding and a variety of offering. With private equity offerings more popular than IPOs at present, there are strong opportunities ahead for Carta's future growth, as long as the pipeline of startup companies remains robust. At present, Carta is more fit than any competitors to capture and cater to the increasingly large number of private companies who aim to provide more of their personnel with features like regulatory compliance, liquidity, and the ability to cash out early investors. As the leading developer of an ownership management and compliance platform that has been designed to consolidate company ownership data onto one common electronic register, they have a clear head start on others in this area. The company's platform features, rich reg tech compliance, and other reporting feature functions. And because of their well-executed startup and growth strategy, they have created the opportunity to be the dominant private capital fund administrator for years to come.